extra special warning. Our hosts do no research and preparation for these movies. They are just two cynical douchebags. They think just because they have ten years of bad TV under their belts, they are qualified to review these horrible movies. Welcome back, YouTube viewers. It's Tuesday again. Bird and Gutter here once again with one of the worst movies on Netflix. And Gutter is a happy panda because he has his Labatt Blue back, none of that fucking shit-tastic Miller Lite that Bird drinks. So this week's movie is Zombie Lake, a French foreign film from like 1980 or 1981 yeah. that is awful. Awful. In one sense of the word. It is one of the worst zombie movies I've ever seen. But it has the worst most... zombie makeup ever. But it has the most nudity of any movie oh, we've yeah. done on Worst Movies on this Netflix so far. This took the fucking cake. When it comes to nudity. Oh. Oh yeah, they smattered that shit Because in the first five seconds, there was titty. In the first seven seconds, there was full frontal bush. And then in the first 15 seconds, fucking pussy lip! Wow! I, that just, I don't know why it makes me cringe when we <laughs> say that. <laughs> pussy lip! It just sounds so crude. Can we, You're okay with cunt, I, but look, pussy lip we, offends you. Can't we like adopt like an ICP thing? Like they say Ned, can we come <laughs> close to that? Because that's not pussy lip. <laughs> <laughs> fucking pussy lips. It just sounds so fucking harmful. Like it hurts me. <laughs> I don't want to come, come off his dicks, that's fine, but I don't want to come off as no fucking sexual predator. Either. <laughs> that's because we said pussy, pussy lips. lips. Yeah, but you put a lot of fucking emphasis on that. You're like, pussy. I mean, this is spit and griddle coming out of your mouth when you say it. So, the, the chick that stripped and got naked, she was sunbathing, nude, of course, oh. awesome, and then she went skinny dipping in the lake. Yes. That's when we saw the first pussy lips. <laughs> I don't want to fence burn by saying, so I'm going to say it every time I fucking can. <laughs> It's fine. If you're saying it as an insult, I'm good with it. You fucking pussy lip, motherfucker. You know, but you're like, pussy lips, you know? Just you saying it upsets me. Maybe if I hear it from somebody else, it won't be so upset. But anyway, she goes into the lake, we see her pussy lips, and then we see an awful, awful green-painted zombie. I feel Nazi zombie. A green-painted Nazi zombie comes up from the bottom of the lake. We see her pussy lips again. I feel like John Ritter from Bad Santa every time. We talked about anal. He was like. So the, the craptastic green painted zombie grabs the pussy lipped woman and pulls her underneath and kills her, blah blah fucking blah. Yeah, well, they never show that, it just bubbles. You know, they never show, like, how he initially killed her, you know. Didn't they? I could have swore they did. I it, do it doesn't fucking matter. These zombies are so fucking slow. You could, like, walk backwards, shove them <coughs> on your feet, and still get away from them. You know? So, as we said, this was a French movie, and it has 80s martial arts film quality quality dubbing in it. So, I yes. mean, the dubbing is awful. I love that little girl's voice. She was just fucking creepy. We'll get to the little girl in a little bit. Uh, okay, we have to start with the mayor first. No, we have to start <laughs> off. The main we have to start off with the fat dude and the ass caught and the wicked comb over. He was kind of the main character, but he was just this town's guy, and he realizes that the pussy lip chick disappeared and whatever. So he goes to the mayor. You realize I'm like a face like Popeye every time you say it. I'm like. So he goes, he goes to the mayor. Pussy lip. And tell them about the mayor, Bird. I need a drink. <laughs> the mayor, to me, looks like Toucan Sam. He's got a wicked comb over. Not as bad as the fat dude in the ascot, though. That dude no, was the really. king of comb over. But the mayor's just kind of just he, weird yeah, all Yeah, he was fucked up looking. You know? And he attacked like this, even though it wasn't his voice. So there's some awful, awful organ music in this fucking movie. <laughs> I mean, awful. I mean, not like church awful. It was just awful together. So yeah. it was just threw a cat on the keys, and it was like... Brrr, I love the fucking zombies, the way they killed people. They basically just went up and had like a blood capsule in their mouth, put their lips up against them, and you could tell there's a gap because you can see right through. He's not really tight, he's going blah, 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 and his blood dripping. Speaking of that, <laughs> the, wounds. the zombies come out of said zombie lake and attack another chick. And that's whenever they munch on her neck, kind of, they kind of go, yum, 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 blood pours out. And you know, there's no wound, no Oh, just smeared ketchup. blood. Ketchup. 
smeared ketchup. It just looked like paint. Yeah. You know, because it was starting to dry all weird, like, you know. But yeah, they just go up and they're like, bleh, bleh, bleh. like I would rather be killed by these zombies than any other ones because they're weak as fuck. They don't even take you down hard. They yeah. just lay you down nice and gently and go, bleh, bleh. <laughs> So the town finds the dead girl with the red smear on her neck, and they take her to the mayor. And of course, the mayor doesn't really want to do anything about it because he spends this whole movie in denial and doesn't really want to do anything about it yeah. until he meet, talks to the little girl. But that's still later on. Yeah, he's like, what's the matter? I've seen a dead hookers around before. And no big deal. Why did I just make him Italian? I don't know. So a reporter comes to this town and wants to know about the disappearances and stuff. Yes. So she talks to the mayor by the lake. There's this big World War II story about this big group of Nazis in France. This blonde Nazi hooks up with this French chick, knocks her up, blah, blah, blah. The town turns against the Nazis. Don't they kill them and throw them in the lake? Something like that, yeah. And hence is how they became the zombies in the lake. Oh wait, we gotta talk about the fact that, I don't know if you were gonna go there or not, but the zombies struggling to stay underwater. Yeah, that was pretty breathe funny. breathe underwater. And whenever they come out, like, their green paints, <laughs> their green paints all running and, <laughs> Yeah, man, it was all like, yeah, dude, Tripping we come that onto their outfit, you know. But yeah, just their faces when they were underwater, like that one. The other two were just sitting there all still and shit. The other one's like, <laughs> <laughs> I can't do this. You know, he's trying to make them top. God, God, God. So we're watching this movie, and there's another love scene. So that means more nudity. But as we're watching this love scene, the sound just completely cuts out. No sound whatsoever. I mean, ran out. nothing. It just dead solid and we're watching it we're like this must be fucked up on Netflix the or sound something. guy left the room a lot so we fast forward a good three minutes no sound no still sound. but then all of a sudden the sex scene's Ooh. over sound comes back so there was another World War II story we flash forward back to 1981 and a group of like nine chicks in an ice cream van that says basketball team on the side show up to the lake and then they all just start stripping oh but boy. booty and naked and then they just all jump in the lake and guess what what? There's the same shot from underwater, looking up with pussy lip everywhere. Zombies attack said chicks. One naked chick makes it out alive, runs into the fucking bar, butt booty naked. Like, 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 you know, like, when that scene came on, Chuck's face was priceless. He was like, oh, oh, hey, oh, hey now, whoa, oh, oh, dude, we, fucking head explodes. That's the only thing that kept my, you know, that kept me through this movie. If your wife was there, she would have been like, get it. Well, my wife loves titty. What can I fucking say? I don't know. As I said, the naked chick goes into the bar. Everybody's <laughs> like, whoa! And then they carry her upstairs to fuck her, we assume, because they just kind of, she passes out, they grab her and just kind of carry her upstairs. So yeah, we they assume they're, they're going to even, fuck her. They didn't even miss a beat. She dropped and they're like... Titties and ass, let's go upstairs with it, let's get it up. So two cops show up to the zombie lake town and they're... that's all fucking Germany has. It's two, two cops. cops. <laughs> yeah, so they're in France. It's France, it's Whatever, not Germany. Whatever, German soldiers, so I get mixed Whatever. up. Whatever. So these two cops, <laughs> they want to know about all the missing basketball team, blah, blah, blah. They go to the lake, they get fucking eaten by the crap-tastic green painted zombie motherfuckers. I don't even know how it's possible these things moved in like zero miles an hour. <laughs> they didn't even make any noise. That's yeah. all. They weren't intimidating at all. You just be like, look, these dudes, you know. <laughs> So the blonde zombie Nazi, the leader of the group, we guess, the one that fucked the chick in the flashback and yeah. got her pregnant, yeah. he meets his daughter. He's a zombie, meets his daughter. They're all happy and he love. He like this pendant, like this, this, this necklace, necklace thing. with a bunch of pins sticking out of it, and she's constantly rubbing it, he's constantly rubbing it. It's, just, uh, it's creepy. Like, the interaction between fucking blonde German dude and his daughter was fucking creepy. After the zombie leader guy meets his daughter, the other zombies come out and they kill more random people fucking. So that means more nudity. More nudity. Like we said, there is a fuck ton of nudity in this movie. So th I guess... Thank you, Jean Roulon. Jean Roulon is my next go-to guy. Thank you, Jean Roulon. Because, you know, we've you done surpassed Fred Olin Ray and Jim Wynorski. You blew those guys yeah. out of the water. Because you have pussy lip. 
Jim Wynorski ain't got no pussy left in his movies. That I know of. So the zombies, after they kill the two random people fucking, they go into the pub, tear shit up, kind of. Everybody kind of kind runs of. away. <laughs> They're like, blah, 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 blah. They knock a chair over lightly. After they wreck the pub, the zombies kill another topless chick. Whew. Yeah. This movie's fucking awesome. It's not awesome. Yes, it is. It's awesome because it is so fucking bad. It is awful. And there's fuck tons of titties. So it's like, my favorite thing, awful movies. And, and my titties. second favorite thing, titties. <laughs> After it's the other way around. My first favorite thing, titties. My second favorite thing, horrible movies. Put them together, and we have this cornucopia of pussy lip that is called Zombie Lake. <laughs> I told you, I'm going to say it every time I get a fucking chance. Yeah, pussy lip, pussy lip, pussy lip. So after the zombies kill the last topless chick, the town wants to fight back. So they get their guns, and the zombies walk through this little fucking stone alleyway thing. Yeah, like they shoot really them like a million times. Nothing happens. This thing's only like 10 feet long, but it took them two hours to get through yeah. it. <laughs> so the zombie leader guy goes back to his daughter. They have a moment. The hamburger-eyed zombie, which is a zombie that has his eye taken out by yeah, one of the wait. French resistance guy. He tries eating the zomb the daughter. They, the but blonde zombie guy. Which, which movie had more pausing and staring? This one or Twilight? <laughs> Because this had a lot of staring, like, just, like, that music, that organ music. Play some organ music behind me while I'm doing this. And she's just like this. So anyway, like I was saying, the hamburger oh, eye guy was a zombie that had his eye taken out by a French resistance guy back when he was a real alive guy. He tries eating the zombie's daughter. They have the worst fight ever. They just kind of slowly roll around on the ground and... Minus the... Because there was no fucking sound. <laughs> <laughs> And this went on for way too fucking long. Yeah, it did. Great. So as the two zombies are fighting, the daughter runs away, and the zombies are friends again. Because they just go out, they try to kill some more people. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> it's a, lo a light lover's quarrel between the two zombies. Here's what Bert's <laughs> been waiting for this whole time. The mayor, right? He, he admits that there's zombies and all this stuff's going down, so he's like, what can we do to stop these zombies? I know. Let's go to the seven-year-old girl and let's listen to her plan. <laughs> So he goes to the zombie daughter's house, and, and she, goes she has a plan. She, she has no emotion and a plan. So here, what's the plan? Her plan was, Just, I want you to give me a bucket of blood. Fresh blood. Fresh blood. But then the great part about it was she was able to do some Vi Vulcan mind meld fucking shit on him, you know, where he was just like, you know, like, Yes. yes fresh I blood. I will do this. <laughs> Follow your nose. To the blood. So they used the bucket of fresh blood. Give me the bucket of fresh blood, Maya. And he was like, yes, young concubine. <laughs> That's creepy. Yeah. So anyway, they used the bucket of fresh blood to lure the zombies to this mill. They set the mill on fire. Blub, blub, blah, blah, fucking blah. Yep, zombies Zombies dead. die, end of fucking movie. Thank Christ for that. And that's Except that. Except for the pussy lips. That was, yeah, besides the pussy lips and all the nudity and the mega bush, this movie blew. But it was fucking awesome at the same time. Watch Zombie Lake. It's definitely yeah. worth it. I mean, well, it's worth it if you like to jerk off. <laughs> you know. Well, it's better than the next movie we're doing. And you remember what that one is, right? Steven Fatboy Seagal and Stone Cold Steve Austin and Maximum, Maximum Fucking convention. convention. Fuck you, Steven Seagal. And what sucks is me and my wife watched this documentary of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Austin, and he seems like a really cool dude. And I don't want to have to talk fucking crap on him, but he was in Did this fucking movie Stone with Seagull. Colds? But that's next week. For oh, Vern Gutter, that. once again, this has been one of the worst movies on Netflix! Pussy Yeah, I did all the dicks and balls, didn't I? <laughs> yes, yes. I love me some dick and balls. You're gonna put that on there. You're recording now, are you? You fuck. I hate you. <laughs> Boozy. <laughs> like, we are not gonna have you two fat degenerate fucks 
talk like Neanderthal dickheads on fucking YouTube, motherfucker. Freedom of speech, motherfucker. Deal with it. They're like, Epic Mill Time censors their shit. Why can't you fuckers? Like, cause we do it too much, it would just be like, beep, 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 yeah. beep, 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 and we're not epic mill time. Exactly, we're epic dick time. Hua <laughs> <laughs> hua. Show up in a bait and <laughs> dicks getting hard. Talk about the girlies, <laughs> <laughs> and then fucking fat boys to go come and be like. <laughs> And they're like, what the fuck ever? We have a boom mic right beside his fat fucking mouth, and you still can't pick it up. That's Zombie Lake. And then we it's, have Maximum. could be a good bit of outtakes of that one. And then we have Maximum <laughs> Conviction. And then we have Vampageddon. And then we have the one we haven't finished yet, The Black, Black Knight Returns. Returns. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm not doing it. <laughs> I fucking refuse. I can only bitch so much. <laughs>